Christmas! I'm Nick A. Myers, and you're watching Craft on Tap's review of the Brewer's Advent Calendar for 2019 by Original Kalea. Well, it's day 19. That means we're only six days away from Christmas. That means we're only five days away from the end of this calendar review, and I'm gonna miss you guys. So today, Lancium has handcrafted us a Vienna-style lager. If you didn't know, lagers are actually conditioned at low temperatures. They can be anywhere from yellow to pale amber or even dark. Um, it's actually the most popular style of beer in the world. So we get a lot of that here in the States, but I'm interested to try what Vienna has to offer. Um, what do you say? Shall we jump into this? Bum, 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 bum. Let's go drink some beer. <laughs> oh my gosh. This has been so much fun. Day 19, let's get in here. Oh man, day 19 is gonna be sweet. Oh, there she is, a Vienna style lager, handcrafted by Lancium. Interesting, all right, cool. Well, let's give this bad boy a shot. Check it out here, folks. And give it a pour. As you can see, this one's very kind of straw color to yellow. So it's gonna be on the lighter side. It's got a fair amount of head on that. Pretty soapy, doesn't seem to want to go away right away, so you know it's gonna be some hop in there. Let me give it a little bit of a smell. Oh yeah, I can smell the hop all day. A little bit of malt, and just an after hint of fruit. All right, let's give it a taste, shall we? Oh yeah, wow. That has a fair amount of bitterness, actually. It's fairly bitter, it lingers in the mouth. Um, it's gonna have a little bit of a malty flavor too. That also kind of, I can taste that on the palate afterwards. It's over, it's overly fruity in, in more than I would expect it to be, but it isn't overwhelmingly fruity. But it's really light colored as you can tell. So, I mean, in terms of color and look, looks a lot like a normal lager to me, but I can see the Vienna style in there. It's almost creeping towards like, I mean, for me, like an IPA feel. It's got a little bit more bitterness. It's obviously not a, a, a pale ale, but it does have a, it does to me have a similarity. So I also want to point out on this awesome can, this beer itself gives its ratings in terms of its bitterness and its fruitiness, its color. But I actually would love it if we could all sit down and enjoy a Vienna style lager together for the holidays. On behalf of Craft on Tap, we'd like to wish you a safe and happy Merry Christmas. Also, please drink responsibly. I'm your host, Nick A. Myers. Yeah!